Hi, my name's Tom, I'm from SignComp Europe, and today I'm going to talk in detail about our famous black clip system. It's made up from a Delrin-based industrial polycarbonate. This is virtually indestructible and has a lifetime guarantee on its own. If you look after it well, these will last. And the way it's designed with the teeth here, these teeth engage with all of our flex profiles and all of them work in the same way. So let me show you how to clip up a skim. So first, to demonstrate a small bit of vinyl. We have a clip line of about 38 millimeters in and the clip is made up of two parts, the clip itself and the mandrel. So you put your mandrel recessed down on the clip line and you fold over the vinyl and twist up, like so. You take your clip, so sign comp is facing up and towards you, and you clip this on to the mandrel, like so. Give it a small tug to make sure it's in properly, and you'll be ready to go. Now, the sign comp systems have quite large tolerances, so you can be a few mil here or a few mil there, but if you need to adjust your clip line, simply take the clip off, like so, move your line, and start again. Rinse and repeat. And once you're happy, you would install your flex print. So this is a small example, but of course, flex prints are much larger than this. So let me show you a much larger version. So here we have an example of a larger print. A clip line of 38 millimeters has already been drawn on it. And the way we would recommend is to start in the middle. You start in the middle with one mandrel recessed down, Take your clip, and as I've shown before, you flip over the flex material, twist up, and with the sign comp logo facing you, you clip on. Now to make it easier to install all of your clips, you then go over to the one edge, and rinse and repeat. Recess down, fold over, and clip on. Let me head over to the other edge and do the same. Recess down, fold over, and clip on. So the vinyl is naturally trying to bend, which makes it much easier to put these clips on. So off we go. We place the clips around every 150 mil or so, folding over, twisting up, and clipping on. Rinse and repeat. Folding over, and clipping on. Folding over. Now you see here, the spacing has gone a little bit out of sync. It's very easy to move your clips even when they're clipped on. You slide the mandrel over and the clip as well. And you rinse and repeat, mandrel, clip, mandrel, clip, until you get the positioning that you want. Now we have a space for another clip. And clip on. So now you're clipped up, I'm going to show you how to insert it into our profile. So firstly, we're gonna look at our Econoflex section, our box sections. You take your prints that are clipped up already, and you push the clips into the channel with the teeth, 
until you hear the teeth engage. Now, at this scale, it's very easy to push in with your thumbs, but of course, when you're making much larger signage, you'll need our tension tool. And the tension tool fits into this channel here, and you twist it to push the clip in and tension it even further. Very simple to do, and it makes creating tension very easy. But the way that our clips work, it's virtually impossible to get them out, and that's why we haven't had a failure in over 30 years. But if you want to get them out, all you need is a flathead screwdriver. You place the flathead into the gap and just twist it to disengage the teeth and detension your print. You change the print, maintain the LEDs in the sign, whatever you need to do, and then reinsert your print. So that's our Econoflex system. Now over to our non-illuminated profile. Fix straight to the wall, but this time it's on a vertical plane, not at an angle. But it's still a channel with teeth that engage with the teeth on the clip. Like so. And at this small scale, again, your thumbs are good enough. But in reality, you'll need to use a different tension tool for this one. It slots into this channel here, which you can slide up and down the profile, and then you twist to create more tension in the clip. Again, with the way that the clip works, the more tension you create, doesn't matter. The clip is not coming out. And let me show that in more detail. Here's our retro frame with a clip already in there. And as you can see, when the vinyl gets pulled, the clip is being twisted this way and the teeth engage with the teeth in the channel even more. So that's why we haven't had a single failure in over 30 years of selling the system because the more tension that is applied, the harder the teeth work for you. So, that's our famous black clip system in detail. For more information, go to www.signcompeurope.com.